how critical is it for a leader to be able to communicate, to be able to communicate, to inspire, to lead, to motivate their team, to be able to, and you travel a lot as well, uh, typically, like most IT leaders. And so how important does it become for you to be able to communicate so powerfully so that even when you're away um, all over the world, you're able to hold that space for them? Yeah, the communication becomes absolutely critical. It's like having a very engaging CEO. Uh, people are motivated to work for the person from a sales, from business, whatever. The same thing happens in each layer. If you have, if you're a, a boring manager, you'll you'll tend to have people who are always looking for something next. So you always have to be engaged. You always have to make sure that your team knows what you want to do, where you're trying to go as a team. Your ability to communicate, your ability to motivate your team become a, probably just as big of an issue of being able to sell the value of your team. IT, like I said, is normally the smallest group. So you end up with maybe you know, two or three people doing different functions. So it's a lot easier to manage a team of six or seven engineers doing all pre-sales work. But when you start dealing with six people and they all have a different focus, all providing to the business, but they're disparate fun uh, functions, you have to motivate each one individually. But at the same time, they need to understand how they have to work together. And that's probably the biggest issue in the, an IT uh, uh, organization because you don't have big pools of people that are doing the same thing. You have a number of different functions and as the IT group grows, you have more ownership, you have more impact to the business, um, and again, you have different types of people. You have in, in network engineers, you'll have security engineers, you'll have e-commerce people, you'll have operations people. It all depends on how much of the business you maintain control of, how much of the business is being maintained by somebody else.